TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading at down 38. You get the Nasdaq down 8. S&Ps are off about four and a half. Gold contract, gold contract down a dollar, trading at 12, 17 an ounce. We have silver flat, $15.37. Light sweet crude down a buck 32. That's taking a hit, $67.85. We're gonna have those uh, EIA numbers out at 10.30 this morning. Notes and bonds, you get the 10-year note up two ticks, 119.17, 30-year bond up three ticks, 142.22. Now, if we go over first off and we take a look at this 10-year, what you're gonna see is this. 10-year, last week, came into the strength from May, rejected lower price, that's when we got down to 119.02. Uh, the strength that we're talking about is 119.11. What you had out here yesterday is that you did come down, you had light volume on the way down, bottom line is that it's going topside once again, we'll see whether they get any strength as that tries to move to higher price. King dollar, King dollar is still struggling with this 95 area. We had out here yesterday is that you got to the price point out here of 95.225, bottom line, gave it up, Sideways move, we're at 95,250 right now. Same type of deal, meaning uh, it's trying to get up into the 95,440 level. That was the last high that was generated out here on the 19th of July. Some of the higher volume equities out here this morning on a low volume market is that you have uh, Snap is down to 77 cents. Uh, they came up with numbers last night. Snap was trading up uh, over a dollar last night. Bottom line is that uh, that baby's down. Uh, the big news yesterday was Tesla. Uh, Elon Musk uh, is looking to take their Tesla uh, private at $420. Uh, Tesla moved uh, when it opened back up at $345 yesterday, got up to the $387 mark. Right now, Tesla is trading down $239 at $377. We go take a look at the uh, NDX100. Why the NDX100? Well, it looks like the NASDAQ as well as the NDX100 is having a hard time getting up to these highs. So it's going to be really intriguing to see uh, if, in fact, the NASDAQ, as well as the NDX100, has run out of juice up here. The last high inside the uh, NASDAQ was the 25th of July. We're talking about 75.11 inside the NDX. If we take a look at the composite, you're dealing with the uh, number on the composite of 79.33. Right now you're at 78.72. Stay right there, folks. Tommy and I are coming right back, as well as some other great program right here at TFNN. To recap, right now we have the Dow Industrials down 40. NASDAQ is off 11. S&Ps are off 5.5. We'll be right back.